Hello everyone in YouTube. This is far away, the guy from the best small island of Singapore. How's everyone doing? I'm sure that you guys are having a good, uh, good time to start this new year. And um, as for me, um, I'm doing quite okay, uh, sore. And as a while I'm speaking with you right now, uh, my throat is kind of aching a little bit. Uh, but I'm recovering. Uh, that's because a few days ago, I lost my voice. I'm not kidding, I actually lost my voice because uh, I was recording a, a video uh, for something and uh, I talked a lot in that video that I was recording to the point at the end I, <laughs> I was unable to speak and uh, my throat uh, starts uh, to hurt a lot while I try to uh, voice out so yeah <laughs> But right now, I'm actually doing alright, uh, even though my throat is uh, feeling heavy a bit and I'm recovering. Uh, I'm okay, I'm okay guys. And um, uh, as for the video that I'm recording like a few days ago, uh, you're wondering what is it all about? It's a secret. But when the time comes, I'll talk to you about it. Uh, tonight, uh, it's evening in Singapore right now. So yeah, tonight I'm going to do a very short 2016 channel update video regarding about my channel. What can I do to uh, make my channel better and um, attract more viewers and subscribers and also aim for various goals in the future. Uh, in this channel update video, I'm going to talk to you guys about three things. Now, the first thing is reaction video. Now, <laughs> I know that you guys have been wondering, where are my reaction videos? Where, uh, where are my reaction video to this? Where are my reaction video to that? And uh, why I haven't uploaded any reaction videos lately? Uh, the reason is because uh, I've been experiencing this kind of problem for like few months until now. And uh, yes, like... Uh, it has something related to do with uh, people hating on reaction videos. Now, uh, I know that a lot of uh, my subscribers, they requested me to do reaction to various popular uh, and viral videos made by uh, well-known YouTubers. And I actually did. And that is one specific uh, reaction video that I did. Uh, one subscriber, he says, requested me to do a reaction to that video made by this one uh, very well-known YouTuber. So I check it out and after reacting to it, I give my thoughts about it and I thought that it was enjoyable and uh, it was very understanding. However, the amount of response I get in my reaction video, uh, the reaction video I did was like, I think like late August or late September. So yeah, um, uh, the amount of response that I get was a mixture of less positive and more negative. Uh, comments especially the negative comments they all hate comments some of them are very insulting some of them are harsh and childish in a way to the point that I cannot even stand uh, reading all of them so what I did was that I delete that reaction video yeah I tweeted my problem in Twitter and uh, a fellow well-known YouTuber is quite familiar with me and I'm quite familiar with him so uh, he wanted to know about my problem and um, I told him all about it and he said that this kind of thing uh, is always happening and he told me not to do any reactions to, to that uh, uh, fellow YouTuber's video because it's actually wrong so I apologized for what I did and I decided not to do so but it was actually my subscriber requested me to do a reaction to this. He told me not to get worried about this kind of stuff because he also experiencing the same thing as I am. And um, uh, he also gave me uh, tips and guidance. And I've been thinking for quite a while whether I should uh, make my future reaction videos uh, edited and only include highlights of my reaction to the videos that I'm reacting. And uh, I think it might work but uh, it won't because there might be some viewers who who love the idea or there might be some viewers who dislike the idea uh, with the the video that I'm reacting being edited and all. Uh, don't get me wrong, uh, I'm glad that you guys requested me to do reactions to various popular and viral videos that have been going around in YouTube but you guys need to understand the morality and limits of this uh, and what it is up to. There are YouTube channels that love reaction videos while there are others who hate them 
and this led to a problem where you guys are not the one who is suffering I'm the one who is suffering this kind of problem and experiencing all these hate comments going around in my reaction videos all this nonsensical stuff especially um, these comments like Oh, your reaction sucks! Oh, you cry to this kind of video? Get a life! This kind of comments Ouch! Oh my god! And also this kind of comments like uh, Oh, you're doing this to steal the popularities and the views. Uh, yeah, uh, I can actually do uh, voice acting. Uh, originally, my channel, uh, I used to do fan dubs, but now, yeah, that was a long time ago, but yeah, I'm doing <laughs> new kind of videos for my channel, so yeah. Uh, anyway, I will continue to do reaction videos for you guys because you guys are awesome. You uh, enjoy my reactions and you love them. So I will definitely continue to do reaction videos. And it's the first thing that I did after I returned from my hiatus in YouTube. But I want everyone's opinions on this, uh, whether like I should stick to my uh, old kind of setup of reactions or my the new kind of setup of reactions that only like show highlights of my reactions to that video. Maybe for some uh, popular or viral videos that I reacted to. So yeah. Uh, let me know in the comments down below. For number two, reaction matchups. All right. Uh, ever since I did the Super Smash Brothers for 3DS and Wii U, or three, or uh, vice versa, Wii U and 3DS, the Cloud Strife Storm City Battle Part One reaction mashup, that video became popular and gone viral to the point that uh, Masahiro Sakurai, aka Daddy Sakurai, the creator of Smash Brothers and the Kirby series, and also the Kid Icarus series. He noticed the video itself, the mashup video itself, and he watches it and even tweeted it in Twitter. I never thought my reaction mashup that contains the awesome and uh, wonderful reactions of all these YouTubers around the world reacting to that character to get to be noticed by Daddy Sakurai himself and uh, he knows everyone in that mashup, including myself. Everyone is famous now. <laughs> and yeah, I would like to thank Daddy Sakurai for watching that video. You guys enjoyed the reaction matchups that I did, commenting on it, liking it, and even sharing it to your friends and everyone around the world. So I would like to thank to you guys <laughs> for liking my reaction matchups. And I appreciate it, guys. And I definitely continue doing uh, the reaction matchups of the Super Smash Brothers uh, for Wii U 3DS for the the characters that have been revealed so far, including the Roy and Wii U one. I know those two characters they were leaked thanks to the hackers uh, before they were officially revealed, but I managed to find some of the best and hype reactions to those characters revealed, and uh, there were like I think like eight or ten of them, if I can remember. Uh, for the Wii U and Roy mashup. I'm currently working on the Bayonetta Gets With It reaction mashup part 2. So stay tuned for that. And uh, I wanted to uh, give a shout out to Ken Foster. Ken Foster, uh, you wanted me to like do like a hype edition and a sort edition of the Korean um, uh, Chooses to Smash reaction mashup. It's actually a good idea, but uh, you want it the v, you want the mashups to be like separated or not? I mean, is it from the way you say it, you say that uh, I think I understand what you're trying to say is that uh, you wanted like uh, the intro of those mashups to like feature like uh, similar to how Corey made his big decision to join which uh, kingdoms, and yeah, I think I can actually did that. But for the salty edition one. Because I know that uh, uh, there are many uh, Smash Brothers fans uh, who actually hate Corrin being in the game and they are quite salty about it and I could do that but uh, I, I, I was afraid that you guys like the Corrin lovers might dislike their videos, <laughs> their original videos so yeah I'm not sure about that uh, when you guys wanted to check out their full reaction to the final Smash Direct uh, reaction and I'm afraid that you guys uh, might dislike the original videos oh my god so yeah I don't know about that but I'll see I'll see I'll think about it there were a lot of Smash Brothers reaction mashups that I haven't even started on especially the requested ones being Lil Mac Pac-Man and Mega Man Mega Man I almost complete in doing uh, a reaction mashup to that character 
However, uh, I have like second thoughts. I might uh, added more reactions in that mashup, and I haven't even uh, done editing the ending of the mashup too. The ending of the mashup is going to be very, very awesome. But my work on that mashup was interrupted because of the Cloud Strife trailer. <laughs> and speaking about the Cloud Strife trailer, I haven't even done part 6 and part 7 yet. Oh my god. <laughs> but all I can say is that uh, I will promise to you guys that I will finish part 6 and part 7 and complete the the reaction mashup series and also uh, putting all these seven parts in one video all these people reacting <laughs> to cloud strike at the same time so yeah uh, I don't know when I will start doing that but it will it will take me like a very long time for me to complete the others but maybe after Bayonetta part 2 I'll work on uh, part 6 then after part 6 I'll work on the other reaction mashups like maybe part 3 of the Bayonetta uh, mashup series then I'm following after that uh, the finale of the Cloud Strive uh, reaction mashups because I wanted to include uh, all the best reactions to the in the finale part of the of the Cloud Strive reaction mashup series. I want it to be like uh, a huge uh, one big hurrah for this uh, character itself that, uh, that has finally appeared in Smash. And after I complete the Smash Brothers uh, series reaction mashups. And after I complete the Smash Brothers reaction mashups, I'll most likely uh, do reaction mashups for reactions to uh, video game series or other like viral videos that have been going around into. Now number three, new things that I would like to do for my channel. Uh, let's play. Now uh, originally I wanted to do like a let's play of video games. Like this channel, want I originally wanted uh, it to be like a let's play channel, um, like playing video games like doing a walkthrough, a playthrough guide of this video game series. However, I don't have a capture card. All I can do was record uh, myself playing that game <laughs> with the footage and all. And uh, I actually did. Uh, I actually did. If you guys are my long time subscribers, then you should have already checked out my Smash Brothers gameplay videos of uh, Mewtwo, Lucas, Roy and Ryu and not only that the Poké Park 2 uh, Wonders Beyond which is uh, the 100% uh, success in opening the 4 portals and the, uh, and the failures too. For all of that I uploaded like high quality gameplay uh, videos from Dissidia uh, Final Fantasy and its sequel Dissidia do the same Final Fantasy but I didn't use a capture card uh, and those gameplay videos they were actually uh, replay videos like after you won a bell, it uh, gives you an option whether you want to save that bell in a replay and it allows you to exploit into video format like AVI or MP4. Yeah. So hopefully maybe I'll do a let's play of like some video game series but I can promise you that it will be like a very high quality in-game footage. I will record it from my cam with the TV screen so yeah. But uh, Pokemon, when Pokemon Z is coming out, I'll definitely do a let's play on it. I'll definitely do a let's play on vlogging. Now I remember clearly that this uh, one uh, one subscriber who suggested me this idea uh, to do like a vlog of myself uh, recording about my life, but also recording about myself talking about. Uh, uh, various things that is happening in Singapore and also showing uh, locations and uh, different delicacies and the cultures that have been going on in my country. I think that's not a bad idea, that's actually a great idea but I'm not totally prepared for that. I'm not ready for it yet and I know there are a lot of YouTubers who uh, who did those kind of things, the vlogging, uh, recording themselves, talking about uh, various stuff that is happening in uh, their countries and uh, that is awesome but if I did I will gladly inform you guys that I'll be doing that and finally drawing artworks now if you guys have seen my uh, older reaction videos I was in my uh, bedroom and uh, I, always I always display like a drawing uh, behind me to associate with the videos that I'm reacting to. I want to do like some kind of a video that showcase myself drawing, illustrations and artworks and make it like a, a speed drawing, like time lapse. I want to showcase my drawing talents uh, to you guys but I haven't got the time to do so. So I, I brought in some few examples of the drawings that I did and here they are. Um, uh, yeah, just give me a moment. 
Yep. If you guys are a fan of Final Fantasy series, then you guys should know what this is. This is a drawing of Final Fantasy V featuring the main characters of the game itself and also the main villain and supporting characters too. And the other one is, yep, my most favorite Final Fantasy game of all time besides Final Fantasy VII, Final Fantasy VI which considered to be um, a classic gem in the SNES era and these are all the main characters with the villain on top which is a rival Sephiroth <laughs> yep, these are all the heroes by the way yep, 14 of them yep, that's right and uh, there's another one I want to show you guys yeah. Yep. Uh, uh, I don't know whether you guys know this or not, but I think you guys should know this. Um, uh, this is actually a drawing of Earthbound Beginnings. This is the villain Gig or Gigas, and Min Tang, the main hero of Earthbound Beginnings, aka uh, Mother One in Japan, or the fan made, uh, the fan uh, uh, translated game Earthbound Zero. And I did, I did this uh, like uh, I think like four or five years ago. I think it's five years ago, and uh, these are all done uh, by using colored pencils. Yep. <laughs> and there's another one too. Final Fantasy Two. Yep. The main character themselves below, with the supporting characters, and the villain, the Emperor Matthias of Palamesia, and. Um, I want to uh, reveal to you guys that uh, I did went into cosplay before and uh, I cosplay as this guy right there yep this guy right there <laughs> the very first male white mage of the Final Fantasy series uh, Min Wu and yeah I'm not gonna spoil what the story is all about but yeah <laughs> he's the very first uh, white mage of the, Min Wu, uh, of the Final Fantasy series and I cosplay as the character. Uh, to be exact, I think it was uh, seven years ago. Yeah, I cosplay as that character seven or six years ago. Yeah. And lastly, the FIFA World Cup mascot uh, sends uh, the the Brazilian mascot. Uh, which is the armadillo yeah all the FIFA World Cup mascots uh, it took me like uh, I think it took me like uh, 8 hours to do this I think I think it took me like 8 hours to do this and all so yeah if you can see closely <laughs> yep uh, Argentina just kicked Italy's uh, mascot <laughs> yep and this is uh, the France mascot and the very first uh, World Cup mascot. Yep. And yep, uh, that's it. <laughs> so hopefully I'll be able to do this kind of videos like uh, later this year or maybe during this year. Hopefully, hopefully I will. So yeah. And that's all that I can uh, talk to you guys about my 2016 uh, channel update videos. I'd like to thank to you guys for uh, subscribing to my channel and supporting me for what I did uh, for my channel. Uh, it keeps me uh, motivated and it keeps me going uh, in continuing doing videos for you guys because you guys are awesome. And uh, I never thought that my channel would go this far ever since I returned to YouTube like last year April or last year late March in doing uh, reaction videos and I never thought that um, my channel would become larger and gain so many subscribers and I would like to thank you guys for watching my videos and enjoy them and I'm glad that uh, you guys like it and hopefully I will uh, I will bring you more content in this channel so stay tuned and that's all I can say for this video I know this is supposed to be a very short <laughs> channel update video but it's getting longer oh well <laughs> so until the next video take care guys and see ya